Welcome to the YouTube lecture series for the Mechanical Engineering Society. I am Nino, and this video will be about nodal analysis. In nodal analysis, the focus in analyzing the circuit is through nodes. Uh, so basically, this analysis is derived from Kirchhoff's current law, wherein the summation of all currents must be zero. The aim of nodal analysis is to determine the voltage at each node relative to the reference node. So in counting the nodes, in this example, we have one, two, three nodes in the other side and four in the other example. This is because there is a resistor separating the node, making it two. So steps in solving, we have first count the principal nodes, then label them accordingly. Then you select the reference point. Note that the voltage at the reference point is always zero. We then apply KCL for each node except for the reference node. Lastly, we solve the systems of equations. So we go now to our example. In this example, we have two ampere current source and three ampere current source. So counting the nodes, we have one, two, three nodes. Suppose we select node three to be the reference point. Uh, applying KCL at node one, we have two amperes minus I sub one two minus I sub one three equals zero. Applying KCL at node two, we have I sub one two minus I minus three amperes equals zero. So simplifying the two systems of equation, we get, we get the following. Combining equations 3 and 4, we get V1 equals 0.44 volts and V2 equals negative 4.88 volts. Now we can solve for I, which is V2 minus V3 over 4. Since V3 is a reference, since no 3 is a reference point, V3 is 0. Therefore, I equals 4.88 over 4 equals 1.22 amperes.